tienes coin. Es el que le digo a Chu. Check the one as a fixed one. Hello, coach. Good day. So, I'd like to find out maybe what you want to do differently for the second test, especially with the new order after what happened in the first test. Yeah, good question. That um, Obviously, we. The, the, the top order that we had laid a platform that we desperately needed for a long time in, in Zimbabwe cricket, which is uh, very refreshing. Um, but we do think that we have a really good and experienced uh, middle order, which didn't quite uh, fire as we would have wanted. So we, we finished the day on 180, 182 uh, for the loss of two wickets in, in the first innings. And, you know, from that start, we would have, we would have wanted to get uh, 450. So, you know, in the last couple of days, we've trained quite well. Um, so it's just going to be about applying ourselves mentally. Skills are there. I think all the guys that are betting in the middle have got some, some good skills that they possess. So our mental attitude is going to have to be better coming into the second test. Maybe the question regarding Kevin Newcastle and what is major? Yeah, that's far from the dog. Kev, Kev is trained well. Um, you know, he seems to be over the, the concussion. So, you know, obviously the, the, the medical team will make the final call there, but so far it's looking good. We're excited to have him back in the side. But it would be a good boost for the team. And ideally, would you want to stick with the team that lost to Sri Lanka in the first test without going to make some changes? Yeah, from a, from a betting point of view, like I said earlier, definitely our top order did, did the business. Uh, we are looking into obviously improving things in the in the middle there. So it's it's uh, from a coaching point of view, it's about getting their mentality and their game plans in order. Uh, a selection from a selection point of view, it's different. Uh, but that that's a question for a different set of people. Yeah. And then you guys, you indicated uh, that uh, you are starting off this sort of starting with this uh, series yeah. before this series. Um, probably from what you saw as the, the technical team, four players making their debut, their performance probably, what do you make of the future of the Zimbabwe test cricket going forward? Well, I think uh, it, it looks an exciting future, doesn't it? Um, I think all the guys that, that uh, came in did a wonderful job. Uh, Prince is not, not entirely new. Um, he's played test cricket before and he's been in, the, in our first class circuit for, for a while. Um, and he came and he gave us a, a really good start and, and you know, Kevin on debut and uh, Brian, young Brian Nzinganyama made, made his debut later on in the game as well. Showed really good signs. I think when he batted in that, uh, in that third innings to, to face those 17 overs, it was a very, very tricky position uh, and a time to bet. Uh, so it shows you that, you know, within the ranks in Zimbabwe cricket, we, we've got the, 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 the players um, that can step up at international level. It's just a matter of us put, putting, in, putting in the hard work, and I'm sure we can see some exciting things uh, in the future. We certainly can do more, um, but I must uh, I must say a lot of respect to to ZC because you know the time the, the time that we had from a coaching point of view we definitely would have wanted to to start earlier, uh, but you you're all well aware of the circumstances that we faced with the suspension and everything. So uh, you know to to cramp in some some matches just for this season, um, it was a brilliant job, and I, I think you know to answer your question. Definitely, our, our domestic uh, setup um, can do a lot to to produce. This. You know, we we produce these results uh, from from not, not a lot really. So when we do have the time, I'm sure we can we can get a lot more out of the players. Okay. Looks like in the team up having the defeat. How easy would you to adjust Psyching the team up. Um, 
look, guys, heard uh, it, 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 you know, there was a lot of work that went into pre preparing for this test match, and then in the test match itself, uh, guys did a lot of a lot of good work. Um, and you know, to just come in uh, an hour short of saving the test match hurt the guys. So they don't really need motivation, um, guys. You know, just the way they came in and worked in the last two days shows you that they're keen. Uh, to to come in and, and make amends. I mean, a lot of the guys there they believe and they know that they they belong on the international stage, and uh, they certainly don't want to be in a place where they survive, but they want to win matches uh, for Zimbabwe. So the hunger is there. Uh, we just have to make good decisions. I think the captain has been talking about that quite a lot. We have to be proper disciplined and we have to make good decisions out on the field, and that's what's going to make the difference. We believe so. Um, if you don't learn from the mistakes that you've made, uh, then we're not going anywhere. So uh, we we looked at at the way we played in the in the last match, and we certainly look into um, in in every moment. See, when when we play the second test, the circumstances may be different uh, altogether. So we just have to continue to think on our feet and make the correct decisions. So yeah, we're begging the guys to make to make good decisions. Okay. All right, thank you.